so far, I think the last number I saw, we are estimating the loss to be around 60 million. Still, Belize dollars. And, and more, like for instance, the, the fisher folks are just bringing in their, their, their stuff, working with the schools, the hospitals. Um, it's going to be tough. But we're doing everything possible to be able to get people back on their feet and also to get people back to work. Because that's what's important. Once people could work, they could look after themselves. The issue of housing is a major problem that we have to address and that we're going to do everything possible to be able to see what we can do with them. Was there aid. a follow-up on the Caribbean Regional Insurance? Was it triggered? Yeah, yeah but that, that to, for us, I think that's, that's a joke because they're still saying that we do not um, qualify. We have paid millions of dollars to, uh, over the years for, for this insurance and um, the financial secretary was saying, oh, we've collected so far was $200,000. So there's something that we may have to t take a harder look at and decide whether we want to remain in that, um, in that insurance um, scheme. Foreign aid, how, many, how much money have we received from Madagascar? Um, I don't have a number, but yesterday, and I want to publicly thank Kabei, the Caribbean um, Economic Integration Bank um, from Central America. Um, they um, donated $2 million um, Belize um, yesterday, so I want to um, put a record my appreciation on behalf of the Belizean people for, for that donation.